We also know that labor can be replaced by capital in human production activities, which is defined as capital labor substitution, also known as labor saving or capital intensive technology. For example, the application of machines, automation, and even improving knowledge and skills can replace some or all workers' labor in the free choice of the business owner. When the capital labor substitution is lower than the market wage, the business owner will choose to substitute capital for labor. There is an equilibrium point, which I define as Romer's crisis point. When the cost of capital substitution is lower than the labor sustainability cost, which would make it possible to propose a theory of exploitation and class for socialism, which can provide a basis for a materialist political theory of socialism. Please subscribe to my channel as we continue discussing how to resolve the human extinction crisis brought about by the Romer's crisis point.